Well, I thought, so I'm going to have a go at making one of these tall net bottles now. Like a really thin, well, try and make a thin neck. And quite a bulbous base. I've not tried one before, so it's a bit of a, a shot in the dark. So we'll see how we're getting on it. Get on anyway. Not particularly functional because the neck's going to be that thin, you won't be able to get any flowers in it anyway. So it's just for decoration, ornament, and ornament, really. Again, the clay's a bit hard, but let's see how we get on. Six pound lump of clay, I'll just block that off, it's annoying me. But just over six pounds this piece of clay, so if anyone wants to know. So I'll just throw a, a cylinder first, as with most of these. This clay. Just get some of the thick stuff up from the bottom first. is using that knuckle on the outside against your hand on the inside with your hand slightly above your knuckle and just push them together and slide the clay up over your knuckle you can see I'm using my thumb my right hand thumb to sort of to stop it flaring out as well, so that's another just sort of keeping that against the side. Stops it flaring out. I'll just collar it in a little bit again and then do one final lift. widen it out as I go when I lift it up because it's going to be quite bulbous and then try and narrow it in a bit at the top Flare it out, belly it out from the bottom. And then leave enough clay to make the little narrow top, hopefully. Spherical. 
flop it out before I start to try and make the little tall neck of it. Because once it gets narrow, I won't be able to get the sponge in. It's not much use as a as a vase. First attempt at a tall necked wide bottle. Could have been a nicer shape at the bottom, but it's not too bad for a first go, I don't think. <laughs> 